Seahorses belong to a special family of ray-finned fishes, which contain several close and equally strange-looking relatives. Pipefish have a more elongated body than seahorses. Most swim horizontally like a normal fish, but some hang head down for better camouflage. The weedy and leafy sea dragons are among the most elaborate camouflage mimics in the animal kingdom. But only seahorses have developed a neck and their trademark upright swimming stance. Their protruding eyes give 360 degree vision. Swiveling independently, they can look out both for predators and their tiny prey. Without teeth or a stomach, seahorses have poor powers of digestion. To compensate, they binge on up to 3,000 zooplankton a day. A trapdoor-like mouth snaps them up. Suction from the vacuum-like snout does the rest. Bony plates are covered by tightly stretched skin rather than scales. The horse-like head is crowned with a bony coronet, almost as distinctive as a human thumbprint. Males are distinguished by their brood pouches, large pockets on their bellies that will hold the developing young. Seahorses are the only animal on Earth where the male gets pregnant and gives birth. Some couples stay together throughout the breeding season, performing a daily courtship dance before going their separate ways to feed. The male stays close to home in a one meter square area, while the female ventures out much further, foraging over an area 100 times larger. Seahorses are such graceful fish with such unusual characteristics. They're just enchanting. Having a chance to get close to wild seahorses at the Etang de Do was a very special privilege. <laughs>